Alright, so this is part three on, uh, of the lineup of cars that, that are in Forza Horizon 3. On to Mitsubishi, we got the, uh, we, we got the 1992 Mitsubishi Gallant VR4, 1999 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution VI GSR, 2004 Lancer Evolution V IIIMR, 2006 Lancer Evolution IXMR, and the famous last generation of the Evo, the 2008 Lancer Evolution X GSR. On to Nissan, we've got a lot of them here. We got the 1966 Silvia, 1969 Fairlady Z 432, 1972 Nissan Skyline KPG C10 2000 GTR, mouthful there, 1992 Silvia Club Ks, 1993 240SX SC, 1993 Nissan Skyline GTR, no, the R32 V Spec, 1994 Silvia Ks S14 Unicorn Car, the fuck? 1997 Skyline GTR V Spec R33, 1998 R390, which I don't know what that thing is, 2000 Sylvia Spec R S15, 2002 Skyline GTR R34 V Spec 2, 2003 Fairlady Z or the 350Z, thank God it's gonna be in there because I'll be making it to Rachel's car from Need for Speed Underground 2, 2010 370Z, 2000. Nissan Skyline, <laughs> Nissan GTR 35 Black Edition, the 2015 number one Nismo Motul Alltech GTR, and the 2017 Nissan GTR R35. On to Noble, we've only got one, and the one that we all know of, the the 2010 Noble M6 M600. On to Oldsmobile, we've only got one, surprisingly. 1968 Oldsmobile Hearst Olds 442. Onto Opal, we've only got three, surprisingly. 1968 Opal GT, 1979 Cadet CGTE, 1984 Manta 400 Unicorn, and Forza Motorsport 6. What? Onto Pagani, we got the 2009 Pagani Sync Roadster and the 2012 Wyra. Now, here's another car that I never, never heard before. The 2011 Penn Hall Class 10 Doom Buggy, the Cola. What? On... Uh... On to Puja, we got the 1984 Puja 205 T16, which I never heard of that car before. On to Plymouth, we got Christine, the Devil Car, aka the 1958 Fury, 1971 Cuda 426 Hemi, and the 2000 Plymouth Prowler. Now, on to one that I was not expecting, Polaris. We've got the you know, we've got the 2015 Polaris Razor XP 1000 EPS. And the 2015 Razor XP 1000 ESP Rockstar Edition. On to Pontiac, we got the 1969 Pontiac GTO Judge, 1973 Firebird Trans MS SD 455, and thank God, because I'll be making this into smoking the bandits, 1977 Firebird Trans Am, and the 1987 Firebird Trans Am GTA. On to Ram, we got the famous 2013 Ram Runner. Now, what is this? The 1972 Super Van 3. Okay. On to Renault. We got the 1973 Alpine A110 1600S, 1985 Renault 5 Turbo, 1998 Clio Williams, uh, the 2010 Megane RS250, which the old Renault Clio is not going to be in here, but also the 2013 Renault Clio RS200 is going to be in here. On, on to Rolls Royce, we got the 2014 Wraith and the 2016 Rolls Royce Dawn. On, on to Celine, we got the 2004 S7, thank god it's going to be in here. On to Shelby, we've got the 1965 Cobra Daytona Coupe. And we, we've also got the 1965 uh, Shelby Cobra 427, or the AC Cobra as y'all call it. 2013 Ford F-150 Shelby Raptor, no, no, 2013 Shelby F-150 Shelby Raptor, on to SRT, we've only got the 2013 Viper GTS, which is rather unfortunate, on to Subaru, we've got the 1980 BRE TGL, or the Brat, as I call it, because it is a little Brat car, 1990 Subaru Legacy RS, uh, Legacy RS, 1990 SVX, 1998 Impreza, 22B STI, the 2004, 2005, 2008, and 2011 Impreza WRX STI, the 2013 Subaru BRZ, 
and of course the 2015 Subaru Impreza WRX STI. On to Tesla, which the roads is not on here, but unfortunately we got the 2016 Tesla Model S P90D, which the P85D is not on here. Unfortunately, hopefully it comes in a DLC as well. On to Toyota, we've got the 1973 Corolla SR5, 1974 Celica GT, 1979 uh, Toyota FJ40, which I'm guessing is the Land Cruiser, which is the FJ, uh, FJ Cruiser is not going to be in here, but, but hopefully it comes in DLC. We got the 1985 Sprinter Turano GT Apex, 1992 and 1994 Celica, 1998 Supra RZ, and the 2014 Toyota GTA 6, which the FT1 is not going to be in here, but hopefully it comes in the DLC also. On to TVR, we've only got one, the 2005 TVR Cigars. On to Vauxhall, which the 2005 Vauxhall Monero of VXR is not going to be in here, but hopefully it comes in the DLC. We got the 1990 Vauxhall Lotus Carlton and the 2012 Vauxhall Astra VXR. On to Ultima, we've got the 2012, fame, we, we've got the infamous, like little bees from Hor from Horizon 2, the 2012 Ultima GTR 720, and the so-called 2015 Evolution Coupe 1020. On to Volvo, we've got the... 1967 123 GT, the 1997 Volvo 850R, and the 2015 S60 Polestar. And now on to W Motors, we've got the 2016 W Motors Lycan Hypersport. Uh, okay, now, in terms of the DLC, we've got a lot of them in here. We've got the unknown Aston Martin 2016, the Audi RS6 2009, Audi RS6 2003, Audi RS4 Avant 2001, unknown BMW 2016, Cadillac ATS V 2016, Dodge Charger RT Fast and Furious Edition 1970, unknown Ford 2010, GTA Spano 2016, unknown Holden 1985, Honda S800 1970, Jaguar and XES 2015, Unknown Jeep 1976, Jensen Interceptor SB 1971, Unknown Radical 2015, Lotus 3, 340R 2000, Mazda Mazda Speed 3 2010, Mazda MX-5 Miata 1990, Nissan Juke Nismo RS 2014, Unknown Nissan 1998, Unknown Pagani 2016, Plymouth GTX 426 Hemi 1971, Reynolds Alpine a, a, a GTA Le Mans 1990, Teradyne Gurkha LAPV Fast and Furious 2014, and unknown Volvo 2015 Zenvo S1. Now, now guys, now guys, I know that that was a long, long lineup, but, but, uh, but I hear, but I hear some other ones. They are the, they are the uh, Porsche. The image appears to be a 2012 911 997 GT3 RS 4.0, a 2016 Polaris Slingshot, and uh, let's see what, and let's see what else is in here. But, but uh, yeah, guys, that does it f for this announcement of the cars that are going to be, and. Well, at least that are currently in Forza Horizon 3, but but uh, hopefully the cars that are hopefully going to make a comeback are the Aston Martin DB9, as well as many others, like the uh, BMW i8, the um, the new uh, Gallardo, well, the uh, 2013 Gallardo of the, um, hopefully the uh, Ferrucci Lamborghini, as well as all the other concept Lamborghinis, along with the... Uh, along with the 2004, I believe, of Ferrari FXX, as well as many others, so, and so, that guy's actually reminds me, leave your, leave, leave in the comment section down below of what cars you're wanting to uh, see come back in Forza Horizon 3 as DLCs from other games like Need for Speed or whatever, so, and if you all enjoyed this video, then do not forget to always just punch that like button in the face, and let me know in the comment section down below which guys all this, and all, and also, still, even though I'm not on it, but as always, leave suggestions of what mods you want me to do in Gary's Mod when I get back home. And if you're new to my channel, definitely do not forget to subscribe for more so that y'all don't, don't miss another video from me. And I will see y'all in, in the next one. Talk to y'all later, and happy trails to y'all, and drive safely.